Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? BX is your boy Daddy Easy here, iPod Jabra Hacker, otherwise known as only using me Tomahawks. Some of you guys may know me as Easy, like I always say, to the black, to the blue, my avatar on my YouTube channel. Yeah, buddy, so I am back with another video, and this is another proof of concept, as you can see right here. So I'm going to actually give you a little bit more details of what I'm doing. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually jump inside the actual um, lobby. Um, so let me just pick out another gun just to show you guys um let's go with the glock get that make sure everything's set up all right we're gonna run with the glock we're gonna go into the main menu i do have uh main menu two on i removed um camera mod which was i forgot the actual name of the mod i removed that off so i can actually see my fps and this gives me more stuff with, let me see what mods I'm actually running, as you can see right here. I actually like this way better. All right, so let's go to levels. I need to go here, because this is where I can actually demonstrate my, so my CPU um, is redoing everything, upgrading my, um, it, I just, <clears throat> I installed the new drivers and stuff like that. So I'm actually rerunning everything right now just to basically show you guys so i reworked on everything that was basically on here and things is going to be a little bit better so oh, here's yeah. basically oh, yeah. what i'm going to show you guys suspects dealt with and that location lockdown yeah, i probably might hear a double echo sorry about that because my other um monitor actually picking up the sound let me just get in here real quick okay okay just go right here so we want to use this hallway right here all right so this is basically my new shader right here so as you can see right here Everything inside the room is like an orange, like a real bright orange color. It's not realistic. It doesn't look real. Basically, my shader makes the um the environment looks real, gives off darks, and it makes everything looks way better than what it is. So if I'm, I'm going to put on my shader right now. So this is how my shader looks, as you can see right there. Let's take off this real quick. And what I want to do is I want to try take off this fog. Um... So we want to do is hit um menu real quick. I go to console. And we're gonna execute it. Okay. That should have executed that that thing. Whoopsie. Whoopsie. I mean poopsie. Okay, so let's turn off my shader real quick. I should have took off that fog on it. Let's just double check really quick. Okay, yeah, the fog is off. Okay, get this off. So, let's pop on my shader. There we go. So, as you can see, everything looks real. Um, as you can see right there, you got a lot of the blur. The gun is like blurry, made it look like Riz, um, made it look like his actual body cam. So when you turn on the flashlight and stuff like that, I'm sorry about my watch going off. I hate when people send text messages just like that. So as you can see right here, as you can see on the screen, I got it with a nice little, um, dirty lens and stuff like that. So when you move left and right, you still get that camera flare, the lens flare. So you're still going to get that. You got more shadows pop up now. So when you move your flashlight, as you can see, you get that illumination. I'm also using better flashlight. So as you can see, when I move left to right, it gets darker. As you can see, the flashlight moving over, you see the light illuminate. You can see the shadows right there, right there where I'm pointing right there. So when I move it over, you see that shadow pop up. That's what my shader does. So if I remove the shader right now, it doesn't look good. You don't get the shadows. Just everything is really bright. You don't get that effect. As you can see, I'm moving on light left and right, and everything is just really bright in this location. Put my shader on, get that body cam footage, especially when you put it on a pistol get more of that effect so it looks more like unrecord
And then you gotta see. Let me see your hands. Get on the ground. Now. Let me see your hands. Get on the ground. Now. I wanna see that gun down. Get your hands up. I wanna see that gun down. Get your hands up. I wanna see that gun down. Oh, shit. You have the zombie mode on, so they want to just rush. See everything look more realistic. Can't see where anybody is at. I got this. Basically, like if it was um, unrecord. I still got more shaders that I need to put on here. A little bit more stuff. I need to put the um, more for stretchiness. So I got to figure out how to stretch it out a little bit more to give it that over fish eye look. Because I need the hands to be further out. See right here. I got better AI, so my team is not gonna constantly keep bumping into me. As you can see, you can see a lot of the shadows. see so i got some videos that i'm going to be dropping soon to make it feel like a horror movie um some quotes and all that stuff so stay tuned for that so you see i'm clearing out the room i did put bit rate um on here frame rates and stuff right there so i can give it a fast pace with a little bit of slow pace with a little bit of vhs on here so that's what you're actually seeing suspect eliminated all units be advised emt is on its way okay. Almost low on ammo. Do not move. Understood. Thirteen. Eleven. Forty-four. Respond with caution. Jesus Christ. I'm on the low on ammo. That was my teammate. Suspect down. He's still alive. Roger that. So one of my teammates was dressed up as me. For casualties. I got some other stuff that I'm going to be doing. I got one with Gary's mod that I'm going to be working on soon. So stay tuned for that. That zombie had no head. Let me see your We have secured the location. There we go. No backup necessary. There we go, right there. So I just wanted you guys to see that. I'm gonna actually load up the hospital so you guys can see, um, basically see how the hospital looks also. So let's go back to headquarters and we're gonna do one more, which is gonna be the hospital. You're gonna see how it has a more realistic look. So let's turn off my shader. We're gonna do this. We're gonna to go to the hospital. 
We're gonna do this. And we're gonna like, um pop on it that I want it to be. So yeah, like when I throw my shader on, notice it has darker blacks. As you can see right there. Okay, I'm turn the shader off. So this Coming is basically what I want you guys to see. The area is locked down and hot. Good so as you can see, there. there's a lot of reds inside here. So this is how I actually fix the color in here. I actually use this map to fix the colors. So as you can see right here, everything has like this weird grayish, greenish, bluish type of look. So with this on, I was able to actually clear it up and give it a more of a egg white um, look. As you can see, it's more like a matrix type of color. With well, my shader on, it gives it more of a natural tone. You can see more of the tan. Even with the reds on a shirt, you can see the red is not popping, popping like everything is supposed to. But as you can see right there, everything is just like really red. As you can see. Now you do have a little bit of the blurriness on here. The reason why you see that blurriness right there is because I have it set up for VHS. So I'm gonna actually show you that if I can do it without any zombies coming for me. So let's hit the shader real quick. I'm gonna go towards my, which is this right here, VHS right there. Now the reason why it has that look, like it's blurry, it's because of this. I gotta turn the intensity down. I got this set to 46. So what I need to do is go towards this wall, look at it, and I need to fix that correction on here. So let's do right here, turn it on. And I just need to push that down. As you can see, the red. Okay. Go back to 46. 25, I need to push it over. Okay. I want it about right there. As you see right here, I had it at 25 before. I want to put it down to probably about five is right there. Let's put it about right there. So that gives me most of that effect right there. As you can see, you still got that. As you can see right there, it looks way better. I still got to add some more stuff. I got to add some, um, film grain and all that extra stuff on here so let's just basically show you what it looks like as you can see it's moving fast it has that unrecord type of look that it's moving fast but it's like a body cam type of fast like 60 frames as you can see it has that motion as you can see right there reason why it looks like that is because i have um where is it at i have um frame blender in so if I turn flame on um, frame blender off like that, you no longer get that FPS thing. But now the problem makes it is it doesn't make it look like it's a body cam. It just look like it's a game with on um, fish eye. So by me putting this on, let's turn that back on. Where is it? By me putting that back on, get that blurriness, then you get that like it's supposed to be more like um motion blur. You can increase that if you want to, but I got it set like this, so it looks like body cam footage, which is mostly in 60 frames per second. You need that stutterness and you need that um just that lag towards it, as you can see right there. Now, if I go here and I put the intensity up for that, um, for the frames, as you can see, I got it on, um, 281. If I put it higher up, well, lower down. Ooh, sorry about that. That happens every time when I do this. That's my fault. If I put it lower and I take it back off, you get this type of look which is faster, but then it has this weird type of effect on here. So as you can see, there's this weird shadow. I'll turn it off real quick. Where is it? Where is my effect? Here it is. 
So I gotta actually fix the F on VHS one here real quick. So let's close that VHS, and it went back to twenty five. Right there, uh, well, right there. Okay. So as you see right there, you get a the little bit of that steadiness. As you can see right there, put that down. Let's put a frame rate. Where is it? Frame rate, frame rate blender. Right there, turn it down. So as you can see right there, I'm not getting that effect like I want. Even if I do this, it's still too fast. So by me putting it back to Even if I go to 250, I get it, but then it's just choppy. So if I put it right here, which seems like 281 is the sweet spot. Right there, so. That's the sweet spot right there. You can turn out VHS if you want to. It's just this why is a proof of um concept. I gotta find a different um effect I can use that's gonna give me more of the VHS type type of body cam footage I want. Bro, how do you got zombie voices and I ain't even put that mod in for that? Get down and put your hand so I'm actually doing a video on this right now. Talk, we got a suspect down. Roger that, 13. Possible fatalities. Respond with caution. As you can see, um, the reason why you've seen a little bit of dip right now is because I'm actually recording at the same time. Um, I got shaders and extra stuff running in the background. So that's why my FPS is going to be dropped right now. If I go to it, it's going to probably be like 55 frames per second. Let me double check. Okay. So let's throw my FPS counter real quick, which you guys see. So does any of you guys see exactly how it's working? Okay, let's turn the shader off real quick. Just so you guys see that it's not the shader that's actually making the FPS drop. It's actually just the map. As you can see right there. I'm going to be working on some stuff. I do have a sound changer, so I am going to be adding different voice mods to um to my characters. So I'm going to do more of a Resident Evil um, theme. So I'm going to be spending some time watching Resident Evil, the regular movie and adding um, some of the um, characters voice mods in. So yeah, I can look for for that. Police department, stop! What? Oh, 
shit out of ammo. Hey. Talk, we got a suspect down. 10 4 13. EMT units lot. incoming. Roger that, 13. Possible fatalities. Respond with caution. I lost all count of my ammo. Okay, see? Nice and dark. My shaders give off that um, immersion. Units just love the way how I got this thing set up. I'm just taking lead. It's not like I'm playing a tactical. I am working on a video, so I don't want you guys to just actually see exactly what I'm doing on my own um, video that I'm doing. So stay tuned for that body cam footage that's actually coming up. I'm doing a lot of work on it. I'm actually been purchasing a lot of games that I can actually put body on um, camera footage on. He was still alive. Remember, I got a zombie on um, model on here, so. Full mag in there. So this video is going to come to an end. Just wanted you guys to actually just see the shaders. As you can see, I'm in a bright area. And this is what it looks like. Everything in here is just green. It's just too much green. And I basically got it so everything look, pops out. I'm gonna send my team over there. Surround the door. Roger. Copy that. Still case. Open for business. Let me see your hands! Let me see your hands! Fall in. Sir, right behind you. Yeah, in case. I don't have to go to the first floor in here. Get that door open. Roger that, sir. I need this one that has the shell. It is dark on here. I was about to blast that. Look how dark I got it. Nice and dark. So if I was to go back over here. Move, bro. Over there. Roger. On the move. I just like the way I got it with the eyes and stuff. As you can see, it's dark over there. You can't see shit. Turn the flashlight on. I don't know why he went over there. Hello? Put your hands oh. up. You are useless. 
useless. Look at all the dead. Police department, get on the ground! Suspect eliminated. 10-4-13, Be careful out there. Damn, bro. They gonna push me and shit. <laughs> okay. Be advised, we have control of it. the location. That was it right there, boys. So guys, tell me what you think about it. Um, that's my mod right there. Well, my, not my mod, my shader. Still got some more stuff to work on. It's gonna be uploading to um, Nexus mods, and yeah, it's gonna go from there. So that's my proof of concept, and I will catch you guys later. That's it, and I'm out. Deuces.